I've been thinking quite a lot over this last week about the darkness. And I must say that I'm not really afraid of the dark. But I guess on occasions there have been a power cut in the evening and I've been a bit concerned about feeling my way around to find the candles. We seldom get complete darkness in a built-up area, but in the country where my son lives in Cornwall, right in the heart of the country, there's not another house in sight. When you go out of the door, it's black, really dark, and you need your torch to see the way. I can remember as a small child in the war when we walked home from the Sunday evening meeting and it was completely dark, blackout. You weren't even allowed a torch to see your way. But my sister and I walked along with my mum hand in hand and we were never afraid. One of the lovely celebrations during Advent in churches and schools is the lighting of the Advent wreath. Apparently the centre candle lit on Christmas Day is known as Christ's candle, representing pure light. The light has come. In a very dark room, that tiny flame shines out. It's like pushes back the darkness and those candles symbolise the great joy that we celebrate in the birth of our Saviour who is the light of the world. We live today in quite a dark world but the coming of Christ is the true light that can dispel that darkness. God of light, please fill our hearts with the joy of Christmas so that the light of the gospel can shine anew in our world.